These are everything but the kitchen sink cookies that will rock your world. Yes, indeed. With a couple little secret ingredients. Oh, look, and look at the cows have come home. Oh. Or at least they've come to <laughs> SA Live. <laughs> I just made that one up, too. And good afternoon, everyone. I'm Mike Oster Hage. That's why you get paid the big uh, That's why we do. Yes, indeed. That's why we entertain Annie while she's here. <laughs> yes. Okay. Well, we hope you're hungry because Annie Vu from Annie's <laughs> Petite Treats is here, and you are ready to rodeo with some rodeo-themed kind of sweets, right? Yeah. Okay. Yes. Those cookies are, I mean, it's just, <laughs> with a glass of milk warm out of the oven would be a little slice of heaven. So how do we get... To making them. All right, so we're going to start with the wet ingredients. You're going to okay. toss in one stick of butter. All right. And a, that's one egg and two teaspoons of uh, vanilla. Okay. okay, brown sugar. And then you've got half a cup of brown sugar. Come on, come on. It's packed in there pretty tight. Here, wait, you need a, the, yeah. the spatula no. or your finger. Yeah, that, is, that is packed in there pretty tight. Nah, and okay. the quarter cup of oh. sugar. Yeah, give me this one. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Here. And then the dry ingredients. And you'll just blend that up with the mixer. And Fiona will work on, we've got one cup of flour with and one cup of rolled oats. Okay. So we got the one cup of flour and... And then we oats. have a teaspoon of baking soda and half a teaspoon of salt. Oh, okay. So just a little Sprinkle bit. that in there. Tell me when. All of yep, it? Yep, just all of oh, it. Oh, all of it. Okay. Yep. And then if we can grab that spatula, you can give it a quick stir. Spatula, please. There you go. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> all right. Perfect. So right now, this is just a, it's a good, I mean, basic like uh, chocolate chip or oatmeal yeah, type recipe. Yeah, it's a thick, um, chocolate chip, and oatmeal. There's, like you said, everything with a kitchen sink in it. But then uh, it's lots all the of flavors. extra goodies that you put in there that yeah. really make it good. So I'll turn so this on we'll low. So slowly you pour in, in the dry ingredients. Okay. Okay. So do you go, like experiment with different things to put in your cookies and then go oh, that that's pretty good and and your husband gets to go no i don't like this or i like this or he, he is actually a plain vanilla sugar cookie don't no adulterate my treats with anything else kind of guy so he is probably the worst taste tester for me nope. but i love chocolate chips i love trying different okay. things um and this one we actually have some pecans because these are cowboy cookies and we're okay. in texas um we also have some um so this is a Three quarter cups of pecan. So throw that in there. You can okay. pour that in there. All and right. I can stir. Okay. And then we've got three quarter cups of um, sweetened coconut. Ooh. You can leave this out if you're not a coconut person. Okay. Yeah, one cup of, we're, we're, we're um, of chocolate chips. Chocolate chips. And, <laughs> and then one cup of butterscotch. And Ooh. the secret and the ingredient. Secret ingredient. This is a cornflakes. It gives the cookies a crunch that you didn't even know you needed in a cookie, but it's perfect. Hmm. I would have never thought about that. that, that, that it makes per, it, I know it makes perfect sense <laughs> when, you, when you think about it. So. Yes. And you can try all sorts of different ingredients with this. I've seen uh, peanut butter cups in there. Um, Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. That would so be peanut butter really cookies, different good. kinds of cereal, mm -hmm. um, just Whoops. whatever you got in the kitchen, toss okay. it in there. Well, I'm making kind and of a mess, but once, once you get all that together, you're gonna yep. scoop it onto scoop the, it the wax into, paper, right? Um, quarter cut balls. So there's two ways you can do this. Mm -hmm. If you like a crispy, thin cookie, then you can just scoop it right onto just the tray. Leave it Bake that it way. at 350 for eight to ten minutes, just like that. Okay. Um, I like my cookies nice and thick and chewy like this. And yeah. So I'll uh -huh. roll them into little snowballs, put them in the refrigerator for about two hours uh -huh. and then bake them again 350 8 to 10 minutes straight out of the fridge straight out into of the, the fridge. hot so they yep. hold their so shape holds a little that more shape. right and so you'll see like the browning edge at the end in the middle will still kind of look a little gooey maybe even a little raw but it's totally fine as long as the edges are as as are crispy when they're, when they're gooey in the inside yeah, it's that, perfect that, oh yeah yeah and that, then that's it perfect. finishes cooking on the tray as it cools so you can just leave it on the uh baking tray for about oh. 10 minutes um, and I would eat it at that 10 minute dot because it's nice and warm and gooey. And that's how you <laughs> did those cookies. Yep, that's that how we these sampling. are made. These are the nice thick ones. Oh, look at those. Hold on. We got to break one of those open. <laughs> and you do, you know, other kind of edible, you know, little, li little sweet treats, yep, right? Yep. Yep. My, yeah. um, I specialize in cake balls and cake pops. So oh. these are these little kitties right here, these cows and uh, horses for 
um, for the rodeo. I love that. Look at the hats <laughs> and the boots. Now, and if, <laughs> if somebody wanted to order about, obviously it's going to be a little more busy when you um, get to Valentine's and everything, but how many days in advance if you're going to order um, something? During the week, I can take orders just a couple days in advance. On mm. the weekends for parties and larger events, I definitely need uh, a week or two. Okay. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> how are those cookies? Oh, you got a dance out of them earlier. You went, yes, <laughs> well, just, this I mean, is good. You know, when you're your tongue See, is it was this. Enjoying, you got that. Yeah. <laughs> he was eating it. Yes. He's feeling <laughs> it. Like He's feeling it, yes. All right, if you want to place an order now, go to our site, essaylive.com, where you can find a link under the As Seen on Essay Live tab. Well, I'll tell you.